Before starting, wash your hands. If you store the medicine in the fridge, we recommend removing it five minutes before you begin so that it can get up to room temperature. Ensure that you take the medication at approximately the same time every day. The next time you take the medication, ensure that you administer it in a different area in order to improve absorption and reduce pain. This medication is a lyophilized powder and solvent for injection solution and is administered subcutaneously. When opening, we will find vials of lyophilized powder and vials of liquid solvent. Just before administration, the lyophilized vials, which contain the active substances, must be reconstituted with the solvent. To reconstitute the lyophilized vial, remove the plastic cap from the top of the lyophilized and solvent vial by gently pushing it upwards. Unpack the syringe and fit the large needle. Aspirate the solvent and introduce it into the vial with the lyophilicide powder, mixing gently until the mixture is homogeneous. With the needle still inserted, turn the vial upside down, making sure that the tip of the needle is in contact with the solution. Gently pull the plunger of the syringe to withdraw all the solution and remove the needle from the vial. Before proceeding with the subcutaneous injection, the syringe needle must be changed. To do this, first of all, Put the cover on the large needle to avoid accidental needle punctures and remove it from the syringe. Next, replace it with a small needle. Remove the cover and remove any air bubbles that may remain inside the syringe until a drop of solution comes out of the needle. Medication is usually injected into the lower and lateral parts of the abdomen. You should clean the skin area where the medication is to be injected with alcohol. Gently pinch the skin, forming a fold, and insert the small needle completely, injecting the solution by gently pushing the plunger in a slow, steady movement until all the solution is injected under the skin. Wait 5 to 10 seconds, release the skin and withdraw the needle.